Now it's time to check in with the man who has the real opinion, Mr. Gino Reynolds, and you're going, what are you going to go see this week? Cloud Atlas. Cloud Atlas. Okay, tell us a little bit about what it's about. From what I can gather, it seems like almost a story of maybe reincarnation mm -hmm. or something like that. What it is is they, each character, each actor is at least playing four or five, like Tom Hanks is playing six different characters Whoa. in this movie. And what it is, it goes from past to the future, and somehow what, whatever happens in the past, Involve, you know, influences the the characters in the future. Uh -huh. Like I said, I don't know if they're supposed to be related characters. Uh, from what I understand, Halle Berry is supposed to play uh, a German woman, mm -hmm. uh, a guy, and I. So it's going to be interesting. Sometimes the character, sometimes the actor is a hero, sometimes they're a villain. Right. You said Tom Hanks is has uh, different roles that switch yeah, kind of Yeah, he that. plays six people. I mean, you got to <laughs> think about that. An actor, you know, sometimes has to stretch to play one or two roles in a movie. You know, these guys got to come up with like four, five, six different characters. I'm really interested to see how well they can pull this off. Right. And, you know, I think it's really, uh, you mentioned it perfectly, it's going to stretch them, you know, and it's oh, yeah. something that going into it, I don't really know what to expect. Well, you know, it, it could be really good and it could borderline ridiculous. I mean, I have one of the looks that I've seen of Tom Hanks looks kind of funny on him, but I haven't seen the character. Uh -huh. So I don't know how that maybe that's the way they look in that time. I don't know if it's one of his future characters. It's going to be really interesting, and what's interesting about it also is this is the, the screenplay and, and the movie is directed by the Wachowskis who directed The Matrix. Oh, okay, and so wrote very the Matrix. much. Now it's based on a novel, so they didn't, they didn't write the story, but they wrote the screenplay. So we could either get The Matrix, so it could be something that's really good, or we could get something like The Matrix sequels, oh, which, which were, not. were not very good. <laughs> no way. So I'm really on the fence about this one. I don't know if it's going to be great or if it's going to be... Uh, you know, maybe out of its league. Yeah. Well, uh, I, you knows? mentioned you mentioned kind of the the possible the possibility of like the re reincarnation with the characters and and kind of playing different roles. I mean, the like uh, the Matrix at least was very influenced by Buddhist philosophy in there as well, and it, it's kind of oh, something yeah. they have a theme, you know. So yeah. that, that it's not really surprising to see it pop up yeah. again. Yeah, I don't know where it's going to go. I am interested to see it though. Okay, good. And what's what's happening on the blog this week? Uh, on the blog, uh, next week, uh, I'm finishing up the Saw series. Thankfully, I'm actually, uh, it, it was a <laughs> tough one to break. do. Ready for a break from Saw. Next month is uh, the James Bond month. Oh. Since James Bond's coming out, it's going to be all about James Bond. All right, well, I can't wait to see that. All, all right. right, thanks so much Thank for you. being with us today, and we'll be right back.